Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video and in this video we'll be taking a look at Android 8.04 OnePlus 5 which is based on Lineage OS 15 and uh, this is a second build for OnePlus 5 uh, build had lots of issues now we have a second build of uh, Lineage OS 15 and uh, in that also there are many bugs you cannot use it as a daily driver as of now so uh, in this video we'll be taking a look at what are the things which are working and what are the things which are not working and i'll also show you how can you install this because on oneplus 5 you have uh, fastboot files which you need to install using fastboot commands so i'll show you that also so first what we'll do is we'll go to settings and we'll take a look at the systems so in this we go to about and you can see Android version is 8.0 with the security patch uh, 5th August 2017 and build number is a Lineage Cheeseburger 8.0. So these are the things and I'll, I won't be doing a complete review on these and I won't be uh, telling you about the features what are available in 8.0. I'm waiting for the stable build. Once I get the stable build, I'll do a complete review along with the features of Android 8.0. But for those who wants to try this room, you can always give a try and it's still buggy or cannot be used as daily driver. Battery performance is quite bad and device also gets heated up. So first I'll show you what are the feet working in this. So Wi-Fi was not working in the first build. In this build, they have fixed that and you can see the Wi-Fi is connected. So the Wi-Fi is connected and it is working fine without any issues. Home button, power button and volume buttons were also not working. They have fixed that also. You can see the volume buttons are working. Home button, physical home button is also working. Let's go and check fingerprint. Fingerprint was also a bug in the previous build. So we go to security. We set fingerprint here. Fingerprint plus pin. I'll set one, two, three, four. and i'll show you whether it is working or not so you can see it detects the fingerprints and i'll quickly complete this after that i lock the device and you can see the device gets unlocked with my fingerprint so voice over LTE that is Volt is also working. I have not used it but uh, as per the change log it says Volt is working in this room. Bluetooth mic everything works perfect. So now let's take a look at the features which are not working. So the main thing which I notice is camera. So camera is not working as of now in this. You can see if I open camera nothing appears on the screen. It's completely black screen. So I tested. Uh, Google camera also that also doesn't work after that I also tried with OnePlus camera so that also gives me an unknown error dash charging also doesn't work notification sound is also not working if you are getting any call the device does not ring and along with that notification slider is also not working so these are the things which I found not working in this and also I try to open YouTube app which is not getting connected. I'm not sure it's a application error or it's an uh, error related to uh, Wi-Fi. So I'm checking all these things and next video which I'll be making on Lineage OS that will be uh, coming after I get the stable version. So these are the things which are working in this and uh, i have also mentioned things which are not working so as per my suggestion uh, you should not try this room as of now you should wait for another uh, few weeks to get a stable build once we get a stable build i'll surely make a perfect video with, along with the features of android 8.0 in this lots of features are missing and now i'll show you how can you install this room so guys make sure to install this room you should have unlocked bootloader twrp recovery installed so these two things are required to uh, install this room and after these two things are done download the files from the description below those files are .img those are image files so download them and place it inside your uh, system where you have adb folder available so i'll directly take you to my system now and i'll show you the process how can you do that because in initial stage even i faced lots of issues installing this so now i'll guide you with the proper procedure how can you install that so now towards the right hand side you can see on my pc i have adb drivers installed and i have segregated everything uh, i have oneplus 5 folder available here 
so in this you can see the lineage os 15.0 and in this you will be finding two files that is a boot image and a system image file so these two files are required to boot up the device and for that what you need to do is first you need to put your device in fast boot mode so once your device boots to fast boot mode connect your uh, data cable to the device and after that you need to go to your system here hold shift and right click you can see open powershell windows here just open this here and once you open it check for the device whether your device is connected by typing fast boot devices and after that what you need to give a command is that is fast boot erase boot so first you need to give fast boot erase boot command once you give this hit enter and this will hardly take uh, 0.012 seconds then you need to give fast boot erase system and after that just hit enter once these two things are done then you need to flash these two files that is boot image and system file so for that what we'll do is we'll type fast boot flash boot boot dot image that's a image file so we'll hit enter so once this is done we'll again give a command of fast boot flash system system dot image image so once you type this hit enter and wait for the process to get completed so once the process is complete type fast boot reboot and hit enter this will reboot your device and you can see your device boots up uh, pretty quick i'll just use the pin which i have used before and if you guys get any kind of error you just uh, restart your device and uh, to install google application i'll mention the link in the description below place that file inside the internal memory and flash it using twrp recovery so you'll have google applications installed so this is android 8.0 for oneplus 5 which is not at all stable so main thing you'll notice in android uh, oreo is you have uh, simplified system settings here everything is compact uh, looks very good so let's not go deep into uh, this software as of now we'll do that once we get the complete stable version and we'll get back to with the features of android 8.0 so as of now that's all in this video guys hope you like the video and if you like the video do give me a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel do not forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching have a great day